Today we are celebrating a little over nine years of being together. Four years being married. Yep, today's our fourth wedding anniversary. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. Where's the time gone? But we are not doing anything too special, but we are going to Ikea, which is about an hour and a half, hour and 45 minutes yes. down to Atlanta for um, a we love. So we're gonna take you guys along on our anniversary Ikea adventure. Oh, I was gonna say extravaganza. Yeah, either one. The first rule of going to Ikea is cleaning out the back of your car, which I don't even know where all this stuff came from, to be honest. to Atlanta, we're almost here. I think we're like 10 or 15 minutes away from Ikea. No, we're five minutes away. We're five minutes away from Ikea. Five minutes away. Surprisingly, we've hit almost no traffic, which is rare, especially for Atlanta. So there's Atlanta. Happy Atlanta. Hello, Atlanta. <laughs> Ikea and it's only one o'clock. We have all day. We have all day guys. All day. Here we go. Walking in now. We haven't been here in years. We came last week to Taylor when he was buying furniture for his house. Yeah. Well, something we... like that. I think we I think it's been like three years. It's been so long that I forgot where to park, so there's that. Yeah, you know, it took like 30 minutes to park. No, no big deal. No. no big deal. Oh, wow. We could do something like that in our laundry room. Yeah. Oh, you know, why didn't we bring our tape measure? Perfect. So Sweet. the first. What? Okay. You do it. Yeah. The first thing we always yeah. do when we get to Ikea, okay. you do it, oh my gosh, is stop here and get a hot dog, a Pepsi, and a Cine Roll. I thought we always ended with a Cine Roll. Oh, well, you know what? Why don't we do the hot dog and the Pepsi and then we will end with one of those. I'm hungry though. And some chips. Let's get some chips. I have on there. Good? Yeah, 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 yeah. This is always one of our favorite sections in Ikea. We have a thing for couches. And this is actually one that we've been eyeing for a little bit. Not crazy about the color, but... I like the style. Teeny little cute kitchen. We don't even need a new mattress and we're in the mattress section. This is the power of Ikea. It'll make you buy stuff you don't even need. We've made our way down to the basement, to the marketplace. This space is equally as fun to go through as, <gasps> I want those wooden balls. We found our first purchase. We're getting a new bedspread, duvet cover for our bed and some new pillows yeah. for the back. She's fancy and busy. She's busy, more busy than fancy. So we keep seeing this velvet sofa pop up 
and we are both loving it. I think this is definitely a contender for when we want to replace our white sofa. Eight hundred. Yeah, these are not IKEA friendly prices. Look at Jolie up there being a cute little model. Who knew she was here? Alistair. What are them? Oh, it's coat rack. Oh. Oh my gosh, seeing these Christmas trees. I am, yes. PJ's sculptural creation. So we are at West Elm now, looking for a place to eat. We got to the checkout line in Ikea and we ended up getting two different size curtain panels. So we did not end up getting those, we put them back. It's kind of sad and disappointing, but oh well, such is life. You see anything you like? Just no. <laughs> so we are at Pond City Market. This is so cool. It kind of reminds me of a bigger warehouse row yeah. in Chattanooga, like much, much, much bigger. We're currently inside Williams Sonoma and I'm obsessed with everything in here. So gorgeous. Okay, so thanks to Instagram, I got some ideas on where to go eat, and now we're going to, um, what's it called? Einstein's. Oh, wait. Yeah, 10. Okay. Is this like this the... Is the gay bar? Wow. This is like the gay area. That's a gay bar. That's oh, a gay bar. I love it. Look at all the rainbow flags. This was meant to be. We were meant to be here. So we finally found a parking spot and we are on our way now to Einstein's. Mm, dinner is superb. So we just finished dinner at Einstein's. I am so full. I feel like I want to explode. And it's like five o'clock, so that means we're about to hit Atlanta traffic. And if you've ever been in Atlanta traffic before, you know it is enough to make you want to pull your hair out. Yes. Especially this one right here. <laughs> he has extreme road rage when it comes to traffic. So wish me luck, just me. We are currently sitting in the middle of Midtown Atlanta. We did not plan this very well. We came down for our anniversary, went to Ikea, went and had an early dinner. Very early, at actually. At Einstein's, but now we are currently stuck in traffic and we haven't even made it to the interstate. This is our current view. Cars. Coming, coming from a small town, traffic is something that we just are don't not- deal with. Yeah, we don't deal with, really. And when there is traffic in our town, we like complain. Like it's nobody's business. Yeah. It's nothing like this though. Oh well. So it's saying that we'll be home in like two and a half hours. Doable. Thomas had to roll down his window in my window because he done shed on himself. <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> Smells like a <laughs> disgusting shoopy in here. His face is red and so is his eyes from no, squeezing out that shark. <laughs> he done pooped on himself. No, I didn't. No, it was just a fart or two. That's it. We made it back home from Atlanta. We had a package on our front porch. 
One of my good friends, Adam, who lives in Atlanta, is a wood burner. Is that what they, I don't know what it would be called, but he basically burns images into wood with wood carving tools or wood burning tools. And he made this for us. He knows that we love Seven Moon Wine. <laughs> love it. We'll either use it in our house or in the cottage. But now we're going through and trying to clean up the house because it is a mess in every single room. Oh. Oh. Not in here. Oh, I thought we were cleaning. No, we're not, we're not cleaning right now. Nope. We ain't doing it. Yeah, I'll, I'll get it from here up then. So, <clears throat> we are trying to decide what we want to do for the rest of the night. I would love to shower, get cozy, cuddle up on the couch, and watch Practical Magic. It's so cold outside. It's not so cold, but it's chilly. I'm in my underwear too. Yeah. I would love to do that. Oops. What are you going to do? Mm, take a shower. First things first. Good morning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we forgot to end this vlog last night. We stayed up kind of late and then I fell asleep on the couch watching TV, and then we woke up and retired to the bedroom. And that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> <laughs> so anyways, that's the end of our four year marriage anniversary vlog. So and that's- Unkept. That's the end of our four year wedding anniversary vlog to, it is at Ikea. <laughs> yeah, to Ikea. That was our anniversary. We're fancy and busy, and we only shop from Ikea. But anyways, thanks for watching. If you want to find out more about us, you can check out our Instagram, PJ and Thomas. You can check out our Twitter, PJ and Thomas. Facebook is The Property Lovers. And you can go to our website, pjandthomas.com, to read our blogs and shop our apparel. That's all I got for him. Until next time. Bye, y'all. Bye.